Health Talk, brought to you by Rapids Regional Medical Center. It's the time of year when sniffles and sneezes of allergies occur, along with various sprains, strains, and stomach issues. So it's no surprise that many patients will ask, should I go to urgent care or should I go to the emergency room? Well, it depends. Uh, we see a host of ailments, uh, minor injuries, uh, such as lacerations, uh, coughs and colds, uh, minor broken bones, um, influenza, which you've seen quite a bit this year. One of our goals here in the urgent care is to differentiate patients that would be better served in the emergency department. Uh, those include people with acute chest pain, uh, shortness of breath, any acute neurological symptoms such as, you know, one-sided weakness or facial droop that, that isn't attributed to something benign like Bell's palsy. But Rapid's urgent care is also prepared to x-ray possible broken bones or stitch-up cuts, something that in the past most patients had done in the emergency room. You know, treatment of acute fractures, for example, uh, there are often times when we will uh, splint those fractures here and uh, arrange for orthopedic follow-up. Uh, laceration repairs, uh, when you have a cut and you need some s stitches, uh, we certainly do uh, a lot of that. Or abscesses uh, that need to be drained. Uh, in the past, people would often go to the emergency room for that, uh, where we can certainly take care of that in the urgent care. Of course, patients experiencing life or limb-threatening situations should still call 911 or visit an emergency room. Our patients uh, have choices, and we, uh, we understand and appreciate that. And so if they need an emergency department, Rapids Regional Medical Center and Emergency Department is ready. If they need urgent care, Rapids Urgent Care is uh, ready and waiting. For more information, call 318-767-9983 or visit rapidsurgentcare.com.